Hey planner friends, welcome to another video. Uh, today I'm doing a weekly plan with me and I'm just doing it the same as I always do. Uh, I'm just going on a previous week uh, which is already filled out and doing uh, kind of like a weekly uh, review and recap. And after that uh, I will put some stickers and some other decoration. Uh, if you're first time here, welcome. Uh, my name is Gorica and uh, on this channel I usually post some plan with me's, flip throughs and other uh, planning related stuff. And I will put uh, the link to my Instagram in the description box down below. So the first thing that I'm always doing while uh, reviewing the week is outlining the important stuff that happened uh, throughout the week, uh, basically some daily uh, highlights. Some days uh, it's just uh, like uh, if something interesting my daughter did. On some days it's uh, just a good movie that I watched. And on some days it's uh, something as simple as going on, uh, going for a walk with my family. So I try to find uh, something good in every day. Uh, and this kind of uh, this uh, way of planning, basically back planning, uh, helps me be more conscious and grateful for everyday uh, things. During this week, uh, nothing interesting uh, happened actually. Outside was very strong wind uh, for a few days, so we were not going out very much. But we did manage to go for uh, two walks uh, because on two days it was very cold, but. Uh, very uh, like uh, sunny weather and i like those uh, winter days so other than that uh, my family and i we were mostly at home uh, just hanging out playing uh, with our daughter and watching movies basically uh, so that's it during the day uh, my husband and i we are working so uh, since seven until 3 p.m. nothing like interesting is happening and now uh, what I'm doing is just color coding and uh, I'm not following my usual color coding system uh, because I really like these two uh, dual brush pen colors these are the only two that I have and I decided for this week uh, to just highlight with uh, these two and to have like a more uh, neutral uh, look of the page uh, the blush pink highlighter i'm using for anything which is uh, family related uh, whether it's something interesting uh, that we did at home or outside the house and uh, this gray one i'm using for anything which is uh, i did only for myself and by myself for example if i watched uh, some movie or uh, for example, last week I managed to film two videos for my channel and that is something that I color coded with gray. Also, I like to uh, track uh, some dedicated uh, me time. Uh, and when I say me time, it's not like, for example, my evening uh, planning routine, which takes only for uh, only about uh, 10 minutes. It's usually me time when I uh, sit down for uh, myself for an hour or even more and my husband is uh, taking care of our daughter. So that is about the highlighting uh, and now I'm going to put some uh, stickers on the page and currently I'm really loving these uh, sticker packs that I bought from our local artist and also I'm using these uh, like transparent uh, stickers which I bought on Aliexpress and uh, this uh, sticker pack uh, which I bought uh, from our local artist uh, this is more like a bit uh, thicker paper and I like it very much the designs are so pretty and it really goes well with uh, this kind of look uh, that I was uh, trying to accomplish and uh, now I'm also adding a washi this washi tape I bought in uh, Lidl and it was in a, a pack of I think there was like five uh, washies and I like them very much uh, so this is not like a transparent washi uh, but it's uh, it looks really nice on the page 
and uh, now I'm also uh, looking for a sticker which would go uh, well on this uh, for example Tuesday because on Tuesday there was not uh, like anything interesting that happened and I got a bit more space for stickers uh, than on other days and I wanted to put some like a uh, bigger one uh, because uh, that way there, there will not be too many like white space and I guess I'm okay with white spaces but uh, it's prettier to put some stickers and washi and other decoration. By the way, uh, one of the reasons why I really like outlining the highlights of the week and doing the uh, color coding is because when I open a certain page which is uh, already uh, filled out, uh, those are the things which will draw my attention first. Uh, the highlights and these uh, like framed spaces and not the stickers and other decoration uh, which is there only to make it like cuter and prettier. And now I'm just outlining the sticker and adding a few doodles. I'm not very uh, artistic and my hand is usually not listening to me when I try to draw so I'm just adding uh, some dots and also a few stars. Uh, I would really like to get better at uh, drawing and uh, just in general like handwriting so hopefully 2021 will be a year for that. And now I am uh, adding that AliExpress uh, sticker and this is on a kind of like a transparent paper and I like it uh, very much. This is a like a coffee pack and it's actually lasting me uh, for a while now. Uh, so after I finish it I might actually uh, order a new one which is the same or uh, similar to this one. Uh, next thing that I'm doing is just adding a quote to this like uh, weekly uh, space and sometimes I would uh, write down the highlights of the week here or put some picture and for this week I decided to put a quote and uh, the quote is uh, smile, breathe and go slowly. I feel like uh, this whole year is very uh, slow, at least it is for uh, me and my family. Uh, there were like uh, maybe a month uh, which was kind of normal, but other than that we were mostly at home and uh, just working from home and hanging out and nothing like really spectacular was happening. Uh, so I like this quote, it's like uh, reminding me that it is okay to sometimes just be slow. And the quotes which I'm uh, usually using in my planner or on my phone I found I find on Pinterest. I would just uh, type like quotes and for example for this one I just uh, typed uh, I guess uh, quotes and simple life for example. And I might also uh, search for quotes on uh, Instagram. I would just uh, type like hashtag quotes and scroll until I find something interesting. And here I'm just putting like the sticker there and also uh, the, I think it's called drop shadow, where I'm just adding like the uh, highlights only on the bottom and on the right line. And that's it basically for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, it was very like slow, I guess, and nothing, <laughs> uh, nothing functional, but sometimes I really enjoy doing these videos. I just sit down and play some music and film the process of how I'm decorating the pages. And after that, I'm doing the voiceover. To be honest, the voiceovers are not very fun for me because sometimes I don't know what to talk about for 10 minutes. But uh, the process of making the page is very enjoyable. So thank you very much for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Bye!